I'm just trying to dance on the camera. <laughs> Actually, I look like George Washington. <laughs> Welcome to Everything Manila! And today, we have a very special guest! Say hi to... Miyuki! Me. There you go! We call her... Bam Bam! Bam, Bam. No. No. Yeah. And of course, this is Frances. Penny! Yeah. And today, um, what we wanted to do is, because the Halloween season... Halloween season? Halloween! Uh, oh, when this goes up, as in, siguro, uh, Halloween is just a few days away na lang. Yeah, that's yeah. Those are... Ah. Because it's uh, because Halloween is so close, the kids have been bothering us day in day out. What are they gonna do for their costumes? And of course, that's supposed to be Penny's problem. <laughs> well, it is. Mhm. Mm I'm just here for the fun. And so what we wanted to do was to. It's so last minute, so we just wanted to look for uh, some ideas that'll help us. That doesn't take a lot of time. In short, these are some Halloween costumes that you can do last minute DIY. So, if you want to watch, see what we get, see what we do, see what we come up with, stay tuned. Welcome back. Hi. Yay. What are you going to do today? We're gonna do it. The first one we're gonna do, that's why you're here, is we're gonna do yung unicorn na horn. She yeah. loves unicorns. Mm -hmm. And really talaga siya magcraft, so that's why she's the one here. So for this uh, tutorial, ang kailangan would be, of course, a pencil, scissors, scissors, and, and glue. glue. And a bunch of so funny. crepe paper. paper. Yeah, no, kulay unicorn. So, and then, ito optional to, pero if you have a string of pearls, pwede actually um, gold na string. Yun, pwede rin yun. Yeah, or the silver yarns. Yes, silver so, yarns yeah. pwede rin. And then, also, reminders, safety reminders, safety reminders. If you're doing this, if you're a kid at home and you're doing this by yourself, um, best if you can have adults yes, to supervise please. you when using sharp objects, can right? You, can you not spin the scissors? Can you not spin the This is the still, little bossy. I can. You can still. <laughs> and then you also need cloth. Actually, means the horn naman pwede din naman paper. Pero kasi dahil ni cloth kami. This is satin. The silver, you can also get uh, gold or purple if you want. You can wear the salmon or, or very rainbow. colorful. Yeah. Or rainbow, rainbow type. Yeah, very good, baby. We're gonna Just use, to attach it to the head, we're gonna use a headband. <laughs> mm. And also yung glue gun, which is <laughs> down there. So, uh, first off, uh, gagawa muna tayo ng flower, ito, ng flowers na to. Kasi if you look at online, yung mga unicorn horn, meron pa silang flowers dito. Mm. So, kasi They're additional adornments. Oh, uh, additional adornments. And um they also have ears. Uh, pwede ka naman bumili din ng yung ready-made na, na flowers, pero kasi wala akong nahanap. That kind of ruins the point of DIYing yeah, your, uh, your okay, way totoo. through this. Yeah. Totoo. Ayan. So, to do this, kailangan mo yung crepe paper. So, puputol ka lang ng strip. Here. So, ma ma medyo malaki-laki, mataba-taba yung pinutol ko na strip. <laughs> Ayun, tapos, pwede mo siyang i-roll ng ganun, depende on how big you want the petals to be. Pwede mo siya i-fold na accordion or ano, doesn't matter, or yung parang roll na ganun, doesn't really matter. And then, what we have to do next would be to... No. Ano ko na? Um, lagyan na lang natin ng pattern first. Ready na magupet. Before, before na tayo magupet. So yung pattern niya would be something like this. Pwede ring ano yung taas. Pwede ring ganitong curve, pwede ring ganun yung taas. So, full we'll draw it first and then saka natin gupitin. Kailangan mo iwasan kasi yung gilid kasi pag dumating ka sa gilid magdidikit-dikit sila. Ah, like the so, uh -oh, like yeah. the paper uh -oh. man. Okay. So it has to be in the middle. Okay. There are also uh, tutorial videos of this on YouTube. You can do that as well. But we're just going for simple flowers then naman, so... Sa other videos, wala na itong tangkay na to, but I do it just because... Ano, um... Tawag dito? Hindi ko kasi siya ilalagay sa stick. So I need something to roll it sa dulo. 
So, pwedeng ganyan lang or pwedeng naka-wave yung taas. Okay. Okay. Oh, baby, can you cut it? Just okay, be careful, sure. ah. No, you I wanna use this one? So, yung laki ng flower, depende talaga yun sa laki ng petal din na ito-draw mo. Okay, mom. Can you remember the last time you actually tried to arts and crafts your way into something? Just the other day. What? <laughs> Kasi character pa rin. Doon sa school lang kids ko. So, <laughs> at improvise. <laughs> Ito ba ang mga ng daisies the other day? Kasi because you were what? Break? I was Mary Poppins as for my costume at school. Oh, yeah. Mary Poppins. Oh. Diba yung hat ni Mary Poppins? Meron siyang flower. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The, 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 the top hat. Yes. I did mine. Ayan. So, nakat na niya. So, you show them. I did mine. I'll let Bam Bam handle yung isang purple kasi it's her favorite color. Yeah. Oh, I did one of them. So, the next thing that we're gonna do is we have to curl yung ends ng petals so that it curves like a... Diba ang rose kasi yung parang yung dulo niya gumagano. Mm -hmm. So, you have to roll yung ends niya. And to roll those ends, we're gonna use a pencil. Tapos, we're gonna do it from this side. And from this side, you're gonna um, just roll it like that. Yes, like it's a mm -hmm. If you are buying your... Ito, tignan nyo, hindi naman ganun ka-perfect yung, ano, yung petal. If you're buying your crepe paper... Crepe, crepe paper. Crepe paper crepe sa, paper. ano... <laughs> sa, like, National Bookstore. It's it's really thin. Man, yung iba kasi talagang gumagawa ng crepe flowers. I did. We have the thicker ones. So, mm -hmm. yeah. Diba I si Tita just, Abby, no? I think I just took it Frankie's Frankie's petal. It's okay. It's okay. okay. So, you start rolling. Uh -huh. And you roll it twice. Twice meaning, di ba, pag naganya mo? Once in and then another once one. And, and, uh -huh. and then another one. Para lang mag-catch you. Dahil manipis kasi itong ano natin. I already did it. It's just Most crap papers here are, are I are did it, thin. but it's oh. just a little bit flat. Yeah. Looks good. No. The, no, it's just see, the there. thing about the petals is they don't have to be perfect, the yes. shape of it. Do it as, do it at your way. Hmm? Do it your way. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Hmm? Okay, so to make yung flower, ang unang gagawin would be, kasi yung pinakagitna ng rose is sobrang, di ba mukha siyang bud na yung coil niya is sobrang, ano, um, mas, mas insin, ang tawag dun? Mas rolled Malik up siya. Oh, okay. So, what Roll we down. have to do first is... I think I should just so cut that masin, uh, So, sobra munang... As in, ganyan. Yan. And then you glue it. And then you glue yung side. So... Glue it close. Mm -hmm. So, there. So, you have yung center ng rose. I did not. I put too much. It looks like it's like a cotton candy stick. Okay. Ang rose kasi nag-overlap yung ano oh, niya. Oh, I got tito Yung petals niya. So, so yung sa first one, you put a little bit of glue dun sa end. Di ba parang may nakausli dyan. You put a little bit of glue here. Sorry. Oops. Here. Oops. Oops. I added too much. But I just put that. And then you wrap it around dun sa bud na ginawa mo. But it's hard. It's gonna get easier, don't worry. I think I just did it wrong way. <laughs> Oops. Yeah, it's not like enough. No, I did the wrong it's thing. Okay. Look, let's go that way. Uh, okay, it's okay. Then we'll just roll it afterwards. Okay. Ayan, just make sure that yung roll, diba, ni roll natin siya kanina, palabas siya. If you notice yung, yung roses talaga, palabas talaga yung ano niya. Ayan. Mine is sticking too much on my finger. And then just go ahead and overlap. So ibig sabihin overlap ko ito yung side nung isang petal. Huh? I-overlap ko siyang ganun. Ayan, that one. Ay. So we'll just do this nang paulit-ulit hangga't maubos okay. yung. Sorry, can you ano? Ayun din. So yung glue kailangan hindi ganun kadami lalo na pag manipis yung crepe paper kasi nga it's going to turn the mm -hmm. paper into like mush. Like what happened to mine at the bottom. <laughs> okay, so what does everybody think? My, this is my rose, it's Penny's, where's yours? Mine is just like, yeah, just no, I'm going to help Bam Bam out. Show, 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 show. Mine is only a show. few petals. See, uh -huh. it looks good. Yay! It looks like a Bam Bam rose. So the next part, after new flowers, would be actually doing yung horn. The yeah. horn. Horn. To do yung horn, um, so we need itong tela. Nakita mo muna yung shape. So after cutting, 
Ito na siya. Tada! So, it looks like oh, yeah. parang quarter ng circle, I guess. Okay. Actually, pwede mo pa ito i-round off, but uh -huh. it's okay. Kasi hindi rin naman makikita yan namin. Like this is the bottom part. Uh -huh. So, this part rounds off like this. So, tada! Can you see? Imagine. Horn. It's a tiny little. Okay, so for this one, we will need you glue gun. Yay! Ah! Yeah. There's a spider. Then next thing you wanna do is if you have your stuffing, na like yung sa pillows. You can use that. Pero kasi wala kami. Ito so yung cotton na lang yung gagamitin na. And hindi kami Where's willing magsmanira ng pillow. So, just to jazz it up a little bit, <laughs> we'll put in some pearls. So, di ba pag nakakakita kayo ng... Pwede na to actually. If you wanna stop here, you can do that na. That's a horn enough. Yes. <laughs> It is. Pero ang gagawin namin, kasi di ba yung ibang unicorn horn, parang meron siyang ridges na ganun. So, babalutan namin siya ng pearls. So, now that we have yung horn, kakabit na natin siya dun sa headband. Proud so, na proud siya dun sa pearls. <laughs> ang hirap niya, te. <laughs> In fair. <laughs> For something that's DIY, it's not very easy. So, I would suggest if you want to do it, use the pearls. <laughs> or use the string. Use string. The, 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 the silver string. Yeah, pwede na rin yun. So, ang ginawa namin, sinil namin siya sa dulo para hindi na lumabas yung cotton. And then, nakikita nyo to parang ears na to. Yun yung i- wrap around namin dun sa and headband. I'm just kidding. Big dollop. Wait, good, good. Uh, the first. Ta -ta. Looks okay. good. So far, so good. Okay, let's get that. That's called ano, parental supervision. But it's not the glue gun. It's not the glue gun. You can feel because it's like the horn should be pointing forward. I don't want to put. We could just do that. Okay, but it's not for them. <laughs> Two against one. Yeah. Actually, try it. You try it and bam. Hey. What do you look like? From the side, look look over there. So now that we have that, um, we're just gonna decorate the rest of the the headband. Uh, with the with the little flowers that we made from earlier. What happened to the uh -huh. ears? No. <laughs> you wanna put the ears back? Nah. Trying to do. Well, so the next it's... thing that we're going to do, um, we, I get to pick. The, I got to pick the next um, DIY uh, Halloween costume, and it's called a Marie Antoinette. So we're doing a headpiece. Mm -hmm. For this project, na ang kailangan mo is white cartolina. Mostly the white cartolina. Mostly the white, yeah. And then there are going to be some uh, little embellishments made out mm -hmm. of paper as well. Mm -hmm. um, we're going to be doing like a little bit of feathers and some yes. flowers, but they're all going to be made out of paper. And we tested it out because we wanted to do some um, ringlets. Mm -hmm. So we're going to show you how to do this as well. So we're going to take your. No, wala tayong lahat. Your your cartolina. <laughs> And then you're going to take the shorter end. You're going to take the shorter end and fold it. You're going to fold it into two inch strips. <laughs> we both like that. Mm -hmm. And then you keep and then you cut it off into strips. So just to save ourselves the trouble, 
of Good. having to cut on cam. We already went ahead and did that. So we have strips. Actually, not all of them are two inch strips. So even if they're not, um, you know, they don't have to be all like entirely even. Yeah. But we're going to be using this as the base, uh, the, the, the entirety of our little um, costume Are you today. Infinite? Yeah. Hair. So the first thing that we wanted to do, we're taking one of the the strips and I'm gonna measure it out. And I, I'm thinking um, this would be something like a, the base for the head, for the headdress. And then and we're once then the measure mo na siya, you'll go ahead and glue it para meron kong parang daan. So, as you can see, we measure namin sa head nung magsusuot. That's the first step. That's the and first step. And then the next step would be... The next step would be just to take um, these little strips. Um, I'm thinking we should cut them in half. Kasi um, what we want to do is to do like a dome. Uh, sort of like the pompadour um, hair. But I'm worried that this might be too weird. Why? So I think what I want to do is to cut it in half mm -hmm. and then just make them meet all in the middle and then just, just glue gun all of it from the top. And where you gonna... Okay, let's see. Okay, well let's try just plain old glue and then we're gonna stick one of the um, paper in. I'm not a patient one. Yeah, I'm not really one for patience either. So while Frankie is doing that, gagawin naman namin yung mga trend, tendrils, sorry, tendrils or yung mga uh, kulot kulot, mm -hmm. yan, ganyan. But this I one, think um, this medyo... one goes from the, uh, no, this one's too big uh, and it's meant for big. the back. Uh, it's meant for the back yung parang medyo ano niya dito. Okay. So okay. this is how thin it's supposed to be. We're cutting the strips. I'm holding it to make it to make sure it's equal. Yeah. Hold it and then cut it. Dapat ano na sabi natin. We just we should have just gone with or making a chef sa. Chef sa tapos sa nagumata na rat para sila tatuwi. Rat tatuwi. <laughs> That'll be fun. So while we're waiting for this to dry, the next thing we're gonna show you is to um, curl these papers. Oh, yeah. So this will become like the little tendrils na ginagamit nila. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna take a pencil and you're gonna take one of the little pieces of paper and you're gonna wrap it around okay that's also easier if you just roll it around um, like from the table there you go you're doing it really well roll it as is yeah. it looks like we're making a pencil into a mummy a mummified pen actually ito na lang. this is the new um, Halloween costume, a pencil mummified. Mummy. Mummified. I did it! You did it! Yay! Yay. <laughs> it looks like a and if you pull it out, if you pull it out like that, it becomes softer curls. <laughs> Your stylist stylist got that. <laughs> 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 Let me do something else for this one. Yes! Yay! Yay! Yes, I can. Alam mo ba sa sobrang hilig ni Bam sa crafts? Usually, I have like cards ng biglaan. Pens. And then, she made a card na like puzzle. So, now that the base is dry, I wanted to use, um, earlier, I wanted to use Elmer's glue. Not fun, sorry. <laughs> I wanted to use Elmer's glue, but I figured it kind of takes a little too long to dry. So, what are we doing with that top part? So, we're gonna make it look like yung mga headpieces that Victorian ladies used to wear. Marie Antoinette. So, instead of, um, instead of the, the, the Elmer's glue at the top, we're gonna make the ends meet into sort of a dome. So, you see that? Make it. Parang mas curl pero pag ginlu, mas uh -oh. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna try cutting a little bit. 
and just like adding some of the pieces. So that's the next step, kasi yung mga ano nga, di ba marami sila? Uh, tendrils dito. Hindi, ano? Ito, uso naman tendrils sa hair ngayon. This is what we came up with so far. So, all of the little curly cues we just put in front, and then we put some on the sides uh, for ringlets with the hair. So, let's see how it looks. Can you see? Ah! <laughs> so cute! You're so yeah! Cute. I think the only thing that we're missing is yung, di ba meron si Marie Antoinette na parang naka- Ah, uh, the, 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 the So I guess to do that, let's just do um, a couple more. Um, curl, the big curl. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Maybe let's just add one more. Just to, just it to needs show. to be brief. So we're gonna take one of those two inch strips and cut it in half. So it's a one inch strip. Why can't you just fold it? Because I've been just using the glue because, because. Because I, because you can. <laughs> because I, because I can and I did. <laughs> yeah, I think it's really dry. I'm attaching the new flower. Mm. Don't mind what I did to the pencil at the tip. It's still kind of raised though. It's kind of big. <laughs> no, it's fine. <clears throat> it's fine, yay! Do this in. <laughs> Yay! Yay! That's what I said. Yay! Pat on the back! Pat on the back! And you're wearing a yellow flower to match your yellow shirt. Yeah. So that's um, that's a Marie Antoinette. So uh, I guess we're just gonna give her uh, a little moment on her own to um, you know show the Marie Antoinette thing. So um, we're gonna do one more. But this little one is past her bedtime. So we're gonna say bye to Bam and thank her so much for helping us out. High Yay, five. Baby. Dami natin costume. Yay. Yay. Okay, bye bye. Bye bye. 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 We found this one uh, site, uh, DIY Halloween costume site, that featured. Uh, making masks out of felt mm -hmm. so we thought hey felt you know let's look for that and we did um, we found one at so I found ito itong mga ganito you can actually find them in fabric warehouse this mm -hmm. one so the, these are the half yards so we have the black the gray and then the cream and then the other set you can tell where these where these color patterns are coming. I'll be I know Hamburglar. <laughs> <laughs> and then these ones, uh, that, this is the same side ng um, alterations or yung so within the SM department store they have yung mga beads. I'm pretty sure all department stores have that. So you, these ones I got from there, but meron din sila mga ganitong kulay dun sa fabric warehouse. So um, I have this color palette to work with, and Penny has that color palette to work with. And I'm gonna do a face mask for um, a raccoon. Mm -mm. I'm doing a face mask of a fox because I like foxes. Mm -hmm. So for the face mask, as we said, felt. So, harap yung animal na gusto nyo gawin and then yung color scheme niya. And then of course, scissors. Some pencils so that you can trace uh, on the felt paper. You also need yung garter para oh, yeah. may like yeah. this way you get to tie it around. Sa palengke minsan may ganito pag sa mga mananay, may mga ganito. They are the ambenta. Ka uh, Carolina's then also has this, no? Yes, Carolina's, Carolina's has this. And ito nabili ko pa rin to dun sa same spot ng binalahan ko nung nito mga to. Which is yung sen. It love na SM department. Store. And you probably need um, glue sticks to make it easier for you to. Mananay like, ba tayo? No. Glue. Glue. Oh. Definitely. So we need glue sticks and, and a glue, a glue gun. gun. Okay. Oh my gosh, they're the cutest thing. We'll show it on. Uh, we'll show. We'll show it there, um, somewhere on the screen. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to get started. So I guess sa akin ang pinakuna, I have to measure my face. <laughs> Just so too. I know. Alam so. mo yung mga game na draw drawing me matong. <laughs> <laughs> This, I guess this is really just um, well, just to be uh, no, just uh, just to be very. Why? 
Ayan, hindi ko na alam yung place ko. <laughs> I, I, have, I have to measure kasi nga. Huh? Okay, okay. Kanina pa nasa mukha ko yung felt paper. Fine, ito. I'll, I'll, I'll mark it for you. Then, then, so I'll mark it for you. Oo, oh, umukot to sukin eh. Hindi, <laughs> ito to sukin. Wait. Meron naman templates online, but sometimes kasi those templates you have to buy. So, kung gusto mo talaga, like no? more, it's, I kind of feel like it's a little bit more fun, fun this uh, way. So, okay. yeah. So, itong ang gagawin ko, ito yung pinaka-base ng fox. So, dito ko yung dilikit lahat. So, it's okay na I, I, I draw the entire fox um, face. Oh, I know. I'll do that. Sabi ko, I was gonna, I was gonna cut it. I was planning to cut it right away. Ay, ba't ang ayos mo sa'yo? Ba't sa'yo ang ayos? Bakit siya sa'kin ang lapad tingin niya? Does it look... I mean, does it... How is it looking like? I think the next part that we are going to do, ako ikakat ko muna yung eyes para lang sure ako na pantay siya sa akin. Masabag ko tayo. Sorry, ba tayo? To, just to make sure. So, my nose goes here. And I'm just gonna stab it right at that. Hindi, ito. Kids, don't do this at all. No, 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 you do this. Tama naman yung sa mata mo, di ba? I think so, yeah. So, we're gonna... Um, to pick mo, tapos... Oh yeah, I remember doing. I remember how to do that. Oh, de ba? Tama naman yung mata na ginawa ko. Ano lapit ng mata mo? Okay. So we're gonna trace the out. We're gonna trace our outlines. Okay. So for the fox, so ang ginawa ko kasi kanina, medyo in outline ko na siya. Ito trace ko na lang siya ng nakapatong. Mine feels like it's predominantly black. So we'll just attach the garter. Garter. So we so, can head. Yeah, but I think we have to make it a little bit smaller. No, I made it a little bit well, sakto, kasi itatali ko pa siya. Because I have a big head. I cut it here with two butas and then double. What do you call the knot? Na to, double? In a single double double. Oh. <laughs> Yay! Yeah! Yay! We're done! Finally. <laughs> so we wanted to say thank you so much for taking the time to watch this. Uh, this was fun. I haven't. Yeah. Uh, okay. I'm, I'm just gonna keep repeating it. I haven't done um, arts and crafts, but I feel like I kind of want to pick up scissors tomorrow and try something else again. There's still a couple of days before um, Halloween. before Halloween, and for you guys, um, thank you so much for joining us. And we want to say thank you for reaching all the way to the end of this video. We yeah. hope that if you decided to try any of these uh, looks, um, let us know. Yeah, comment down below. And please don't forget to like this video and also hit that subscribe button and that bell notification icon so you know when we have a new video up. And also like us on Facebook. Facebook, definitely. So once again, thank you so much for watching. This has been Francis. Penny. And this is Everything Manila. Happy Halloween. Bye. Bye.